a new game. What's it? New game. All right, Sonor Fun Machine. Let's see what you got for me today. Ah, dang, it's Limousine's Hot Babely and Odyssey. Loosely based on the life and times of the coolest rock band in the world, Limousine. Okay, Hot Babelians, get ready to be rescued and romanced by my rock and roll rulage. Wait, do I have to play this? I am playing this. Hey, what was that? No. Please. No, no, no. No. Come on, man. Don't do this to me. Ah! Go on. Get. Scram. Oh, crap cakes. Not again. I just sprayed three cans of 4WD in the cartridge slot this morning. Looks like I'll have to take it to the only fully licensed vid electrician in town. Bubs. Don't worry, my poor I hear the sign. machine. Bubs will fix you up better than new. All right, the tarantula black metal detector. Now with built-in shovel attachment. You know, I would like to state for the record. I love games. That. That's a teaser poster for the off-delayed cinematic classic to be Dangerous 3. The Criminal Projective. Mm. Wait. Oh, we already have it. I was like, wait, we gotta get the machine, but we already have it. Let's just go in the house and gather inventory items as you do. You know how adventure games work, right? You go get you go get all the you find items laying around and you fetch them. It's a big old fetch quest. Check the fridge. Oh. Sweet! A can of wallapino flavored aerosol cheese! Easily one of my top five foamy orange food products ever. We have some wallapino cheese. Nice. Strong Sad ordered this bookshelf from one of them designy foreign put it together yourself catalogs. This little guy is called Flurgen Drool. Strong Sad ordered Flurgen. What's that? That's my Totalmatic Sudden Shot camera. It's so obsolete that it actually uses a mysterious substance known as film to make pictures. Whoa, exotic. Can I borrow it? No way, Strong Bad. Please. Hey there, Sister Christian. Remarkably, I don't have time for you today, Strong Bad. You don't know anything about a bat infestation, do you, Count Succula? Ah, I see you've met the Von Blaubloods. The Von what? The Von Blaubloods. A rich lineage of fruit bats I'm raising in my bat hutch. I don't care how cool their last name is. Tell them to stay out of my room. I don't know how to tell you this, but someone broke the fun machine. Someone? Yeah, I think it was someone Jackson, or maybe someone Jackson Jr. Can you fix it? No, but Bubs has a black belt in fixing outdated electronics. Was it Joey Jojo but Jr. Will Shabadoo? Make me pay for it with money. I also accept firstborn children. I'm sure I'll instantly regret asking this, but uh, what you doing? 
I've finally decided to pursue my dream of becoming a snooty rock and roll journalist. A rock and roll journal? <laughs> you won't be blah ha ha after I've sold the poignant coming of age tale of my snooty exploits to a snooty independent movie studio. You're right. I, I shouldn't. <laughs> oh. Well, the bile in my throat tells me it's time to stop talking to you. I've got a fun machine to get repaired. Hollering Jimmy's bat hutch kit? Since when do you keep bats in your room? Not just any bats. The Von Blaubloods are an extended family of majestic Boom, and they're majestic. Bats. They inspire me. To what? Get rabies? Welcome to Mildew City. Please, fasten your gag reflex. Hey, it's a sword. Hey, how'd you get your fake dress-up sword out of Pom Pomerania? Or Club Techno Chocolate? That, my friend, is a tale fraught with intrigue, drama, and mild adventure. It all started Yeah, yeah, stop talking. Can I borrow it? No. I'll do it anyway. Come on, let me borrow your wussy role-playing sword. Not for all the golden peasantry. Hey, little man. Where's my pick? What's new in your monosyllabic world? Cool types. Oh, band practice, huh? Have you kicked marzipan out yet? She brings snacks. Fair enough. Now, don't freak out, big fella. But yes. I got some bad news about the fun machine. Fun machine, okay? Not exactly. See, there's been an accident and... Make better! Must play Lady Snake Parade! Okay, okay, I'll make the fun machine better. Man, Lady Snake Parade! Did you know that Strong Sat is raising bats with a cool last name in his room? Save the bats! La la la! Some of these knows. Well, this has been fascinating and articulate, but I got a fun machine to repair. See you later, S Mad. Come on in here. <laughs> Man, that painting is creepy. This game is jank. It's strong mad stuffed dinosaur, <laughs> Pudonkus. Hey, Muscles, mind if I borrow this? Pudonkus! Guess so. This is Belinda, strong mad's favorite dumbbell. She's a bit on the heavy side, but she has a great personality. Strong Mad plays a heavy bass. Literally. The strings are actually those cables they use to hold up bridges. Am I strong or bad? This is where my brother keeps all his extra singlets, gym socks, and athletical supporting I feel devices. like I'm kind of bad. Whoa! There's something I haven't seen in, like, forever. Strong Sad cried for days when I defaced this record into the most awesome album cover idea ever. I bet you could sell like a kajillion records if you put together an album cover like this. It's in my inventory now. It's mine now. Later, nerds. Just as I thought. Crinkly. Strong Sad still has one of those plastic wet the bed liners under his sheets. I don't know if I'm strong, but I'm definitely bad. Stop grabbing at my stuff. No. I must have left my lighter here during last night's candlelight Spemales After Dark session. Mm. Emails, 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 emails! One email. Yo, S to the B. I'm trying to come up with a good name for my band, but it seems like all of the good ones are taken. Any ideas? No name brand band. That's true, Brandy. All the good ones are taken. 
That's why you need to start thinking of futuristic band names. Like My Personal Jetpack, or The Robot Rebellion, ooh, ooh, or Really, Really, Really Tiny Cell Phone. That should be enough to get you started. But I'm gonna need my royalties in the year 2086 dollars. Or Globnars, as they will then be called. Thanks, SB. You hear that? Globnars. They're gonna be called Globnars. Just remember that. For when it happens. Nothing new here. Nothing new here. I think this little patch of ground is already horked up its share of treasure today. Band practice in marzipans is always good for a little heckling. Where should I put her house? We're back to the first one where we put people's houses places. Bubs, you gotta help me. It's my fun machine. It's broken. It is? Well, we can fix that no problem. Oh, good. I was afraid that that'll be one big sack of cash. One big sack of what? One big sack of cash. This is gonna be a tricky job. I gotta order some parts, hire some skilled labor, go back to night school, maybe take some tap lessons. How am I gonna get a big sack of cash? You could get a job. I sure could use an apprentice grime taster. No, there has to be a more convoluted way. But how? Ew. That's it! I'll put on a battle royale of the bands and use the profits to fix my fun machine. I know all about putting on concerts, Strong Bad. I'll even help you out. You will? Sure, I love little side projects. I'm knitting a winter vest with my feet right now. See? Terrifying. So, who should I get for my battle royale of the bands? Slow down there, strong band. Before you start signing strong up band. for the you're gonna need two things. Security and celebrity judges. Boring. Without celebrity judges, no one's gonna bother to come see the kind of fourth-rate acts that'll pay to be in a contest. And without someone running security, who'll monitor the line to the cold one stand? The mist tent, the porta potties. What a crap one's that job? I don't know, man. But while you were staring at my feet, I made you this deluxe security jacket. Get some poor sap to wear this thing and find me some celebrity judges. That will be an illegitimate business. This must be what Bubs used to make that lame security jacket. Hey, what's this? Some kind of old contest entry form? Win a rip-roaring rock debut with Limousine's album cover design contest. If you've got a photo that you think is tough enough, simply scribble your name and address on the back, slap on a stamp, and send it to blah, 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 blah. If your photo is chosen, you get to spend a whole day with Limousine for your rip-roaring rock debut. Whoa, an entire day with Limousine at my call and back. That would be... So tremendously awesome that it kind of hurts my brain and I maybe need some aspirin. Yeah, that. What's this jobby here, Bubs? That's my diamond encrusted plantanium record I got back in the day for selling a bajillion records. Oh, from your days with the duo duo. Don't you say that name old. Looking for stuff. There's the stick. What's oh, a starfish? Eat at Bubs. Do I have to? Bubs doesn't need this light dead star. Why does he waste money on advertising when he's the only game in town? 
Andy's right over there. There's a whale. Fence. to strut down Hollywood Boulevard in this pair of Hollywood Boulevards. I gotta try these on at the photo booth. Y'all want me to email you my costumes? That I make in the photo booth? That what you desperately want? Hmm, that oil slick is new. Maybe it also has smoke screen and missiles. Can we light it on fire? Now, what was it Strong Sad told me about cleaning oil spills? Um, set it on fire. Thanks, big little brother. I never said that. Too late. Okay, not too shabby. But it's still not quite jumping out at me and tearing out my jugular. All right. Well, we kind of know what we're doing now. from the last duo duo concert before their unfortunate breakup oh, all the stuff we found carefully arranging this rock in my pants will enhance my overall serenity for my money, nothing calms the jangled nerves like screwing with Marzipan Zen Garden. For my money, not We can't go this way anymore. We have to ring the doorbell. Or just walk in the door. Hey, teenage lobotomy. Don't bother me, Strong Bear. I've got snooty rock journalism to pursue. How'd Marzipan get two kind of cool guys like Strong Matt and the Cheat in her band anyway? She lets them each write one song per album. Ah, that would explain a lot. Hey, I got a story for you, Mr. Snooty Rock Journalist. Prepare ye all butts for maximum kickage as Strong Bad organizes a legendary battle royale of the bands! No, you're not. No, really. It'll have security and celebrity judges and everything. And ponies? Yeah, and ponies. Hey. Check out this article of clothing. What is it? It's a security jacket. You know, the kind worn by security guards at concerts. Oh, I can't stand those guys. They're always laughing at my press pass. What drags you out to Cool Tape's practice space? And ponies, er, waste yeah. of space. I'm covering the Cool Tape's ponies. preparations for their next gig. A benefit concert for the vegan albino bat. Wow. Slow music news day, huh? I'm also keeping my ears open for chatter about any hot new acts. The Cool Tapes have lots of connections in the underground music scene. Well, you're lame and I'm awesome. Bye. See ya. Yikes, that is one pathetic looking bat. For your information, Strong Bad, that is Pasquale, an endangered and precious Lithuanian albino vegan bat. Lies. What's the wide, big guy? Lithuanian? 
You can talk to him after rehearsal, Strong Bad. You're not his mom. Man, you gotta stop wasting your time with Marzipan and join a real band. I don't know something with that was there with it, man. A three album deal with guaranteed four point back end? Ding dang, maybe I should join the cool tapes. Maybe you should stop interrupting our rehearsals. Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is it, Strong Bad? What are you guys practicing for? The cool tapes have been invited to perform at a concert to benefit the endangered Lithuanian albino vegan bat, like poor Paz Quell over there. Yuck, yuck. <laughs> yuck, yuck. What are you guys practicing for? Oh. The cool tapes quell over there. Yuck, yuck. What's Strong Sad doing lurking around here? He thinks he's some kind of a snooty rock journalist now, but I think he's here to raid my bran muffins. I am not. Stay on cool. You know it. That's the original Cool Tapes graffiti that gave Marzipan the idea for her band. Considering Homestar painted it, she's lucky both words are spelled correctly. Japan always keeps her kitchen boarded up when Strong Mad's around. You're welcome. Alrighty. What to do now? What do now? What what do now? Check my email is the answer, because I got an email while I was out. The answer is obviously check my email. I got an email while I was out. When in doubt, check your email. Three, two, one, ignition. Gentlemen, we have emails. Dear Strongman, in your opinion, what era of rock rocked the hardest? Looking for validation, Mark Derrick! Sorry, Mark. I don't validate. Maybe check with pubs. But I can tell you exactly when rock rocked the hardest. When you're 18 to 24 years old. But if you're over 24, man, sucks to be you. Because music rocks less and less with each passing year. Until the next thing you know, you're listening to the oldie station and playing air guitar at a stoplight next to a car full of teenagers that spit and laugh at you. Stupid kids. They call that noise music. Curmudgeoningly, strong bat. <laughs> oh, he's gone. We can steal With his the camera. Automatic sudden shot at my side. I'll totally be able to shoot all sorts of automatic pictures. Suddenly. We can steal all the stuff now. Get wrecked, you nerds. We're gonna steal everything. Welcome to Mildew City. Not sure which is duller, my brother or his padded safety sword. Let's call it a tie. So wait, these are, they're all brothers? Ah, the mighty Pudonkis. His natural camouflage made him virtually invisible to predators in his native environment, which was, apparently, a clown's house. Come 
someone in here. Man, that painting is creepy. Yoinking everything. We're just going on a yoink fest here. Strong side order Flurgan. Yeah, we know that. We already read that. Alright, so we're gonna duplicate the record. Take a picture of it. Send it in the mail. And they're gonna be our celebrities. That is what is happening here. I don't know exactly how we're gonna duplicate it, but we are. Through the magic of forced perspective, the unsuspecting automobile is threatened by the long thought extinct giant poo donkeys! Arr! Oh, that's the one I want. Man, younger me was a genius. If I can take a photo that looks like this crude drawing, I'm a cinch to win that limousine contest. Okay, we got a sword. We got a sword and a whatever that is. I don't. Uh, oh, the starfish. Okay. One fish, two fish, starfish, carfish. I think I like you, glowy starfish. You do not make me want to barfish. If I want a sword on my album cover, I'm going to need a hot blonde to be holding it. Or at least a blonde. How, how, how are we going to do that? That one I don't know. Hmm. It. I knew Marzipan was gonna be a blonde. Yo! Bring it down, gang. What now, strong bad? Well, I'll let you get Goodbye. Not sure if it's her though. I bet you could sell like a good Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is it, strong bad? What are you guys practicing? The cult queller. Okay. Stay on cool. You know it. Hmm. Well. Bubs! Strong man! How's it shaking, bacon? You know how hard it is to find A-list celebrities in this Z-list town? Tell me about it. For my last infomercial, I skipped the A-list, the B-list, and went straight to the FBI most wanted list. Though Biscuit Dough Hands Man sure helped me sell a lot of food processors. Hey, Bubs, if I won a day with Limousine, do you think they'd be good celebrity judges for my concert? Limousine? Yeah, I bet they have just the right amount of washed up to be perfect celebrity judges. How am I gonna get anyone to wear this ridiculous security jacket? Why don't you try lying through your teeth? It always works for me. What about lying through your rectangular mouth? Yeah, I suppose that'd work, toothless. I can't believe you're making me pay actual real money for my fun machine repairs. Believe it. Well, I've got... See you later! Check out my Squealin' Larry limousine microphone! Yeah! 
Whoa, I sound awesome. I bet I could make all kinds of cardboard boxes materialize out of thin air with this thing. I'm just saying. Alrighty then. This sword is as dull and weak as Strong Sad himself. It can't cut through anything. Nope. I think the Zen Rock would feel more aligned with its Shaka Khans somewhere else. I think the Zen Rock. Man, I gotta stop getting my thumb in front of the lens. Maybe that's what we need to do. Wait, no? The picture's not there. Dang it. Yo! Bring it down, gang. What now? Well, I'll let you... Goodbye! Oh, maybe we could... I don't know. Kind of hoping. If I want a sword on my own. <sighs> oh, what do I need to do? Okay, I have I have a new idea. Maybe we need to join their band. And he, that's what the microphone's for. This doesn't look like they have a vocalist. I'll let me hear you come out. Nope. Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is hey, a strong Claire. bad? What's strong sad doing? He thinks he's some kind of a snooty rock journalist now. I am not. Stay on cool. You know it. Not bad, but not good either. Yo! Bring it down. Dang what? it, why do I keep doing that? Well, I'll let you... Goodbye. I don't understand why I keep doing that. Yeah, I don't think I'll keep this. <sighs> Wait. What if I give her the sword? Hey, Marzipan! What? Could you hold this for me? Why? I'm working on this album cover and I need a hot blonde to pose in a bikini with a giant sword on top of a flaming car! And even though you really aren't all that hot... Uh... So, you'll think about it? Lucky for me, Marzipan's not the only blonde in town. Uh, okay. Who's who? 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 Who else have we got? We have the cheat. Hey, the cheat! I've got a great idea. Mm -hmm. I need a hot blonde to hold this sword for the greatest album cover ever, and you're the closest thing available. Mm -hmm. I knew I could count on you to cheat. 
I'll see you later at the shoot. Don't forget to wear a bikini. Ah, okay. I mean, I guess that works. Okay, I'm feeling lucky about this one. Let's see now. Dinosaur, check. Burning car, check. Imploding star, check. Hot blonde with a sword, check. Looks like we're ready to make some album cover history. Hey, the cheat, why don't you give us a good scream? Something that says terrified, determined, and oh, my loincloth. <laughs> Whoa, this is great! I better take this before I lose the light or something. Man, did I choose the right lens or what? This is like <laughs> the coolest album cover ever! I better send this off to Limousine before its coolness freezes a hole through my pants. Alright. Okay, let's do this thing. We're in a day with limousine contest. Staten Island, 10301. Limousine album immortality, here I come. Dear Mr. Bat, are you ready to rock harder than anyone in your pimply male teenage peer group has ever rocked? Because your bodacious album cover is the winner of the Rip Roar and Rock Devoo with Limousine Contest. Just let us know when and where, and we'll be there, ready to suck your rocks off. Keep on seeing limousine. All right. All right. All right. Check our email. I feel like we're making some good progress. When I say e, you say mail. E, mail, e, mail. Nothing. Whoops. Today's the 14th. Last, last, the last game, it was the 13th. Today, it's the 14th. I found some celebrity judges for the Battle of the Bands. Who that? Oh, just a little small time band called Limousine. Limousine? I'll make millions selling hairspray and scarves. Now just find somebody dumb enough to handle security and we can start signing up some bands. I'm trying, I'm trying, but it's a really ugly jacket. You have to trick someone into putting it on. Anything interesting. So, about that jacket I showed you. Yes. It's not really a security jacket. It's actually a tour jacket for the obscure new indie band called Security. Security? I've heard people talking about them. A lot of people. See, they're hot. 
The talk is cheap. Legit indie bands have street teams that use guerrilla marketing tactics to get their name and logo up all over the place. All right. I see. I'm going to put this on the brick wall. I don't seem to have the brick wall on my stuff. Oh, we can put it on the fence, maybe. This seems like a good place for a stencil. And cheese. Now that's a spicy bit of graffiti. Excuse me, is this the fabled fence where all the hipsters vandalize public property with the names of their favorite bands? Why, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, good. I'm a snooty rock journalist looking for the next big thing to be pretentious about. Do tell. Security. Hmm. So, about that jacket I showed you. Yes. It's not really a security jacket. It's actually a tour jacket for the obscure new indie band called Security. Security? The hot new band that everyone's talking and vandalizing about? That's the one. Where'd you get that jacket? I have to have one. Yeah, good luck with that. These babies were snatched up by all the hipsters weeks ago. Oh. I guess I could let you borrow mine for a while. Really? As long as you promise not to get any failure on it. I promise I won't fail you. Hip Indie Credville, here I come. How do I look? Like a guy who's totally tapped into today's underground music scene. I'm going to show this off to everybody. Yeah, you do that. <laughs> hey, security guy. Is that what they call fans of security? Interesting. Well, hello yourself, security guy. No, dummy. That's what I call dummies who've signed up to run security at Strong Bad's Battle of the Bands. Oh, but... You're wearing my security jacket, ain't you? Yes, but... So take this billy club and get securitizing. Okay... Well, now that you've gotten some celebrity judges and duped that poor marshmallow boy into running security, it's time to start signing up some acts. Some acts? That's a great idea! Here are the entry forms. I'd say entry fees from three bands would be enough to cover your video game repairs. Three it is. Let me just put on my invisible concert promoter hat. There we go. Time to sign up some crappy bands. And I'll get started building some stages. So, Bubs, got any hot tips on cool bands? Well, there's the cool tapes over at Miser Fans, Pom Poms over at the club, Hey, didn't you and Coach Z used to be in a band? Coach Z, don't talk to me about that big green sellout! Hey, that opened new locations! Yeah, boy! To, uh, talk to Coach Z if I want to get him and Bubs back together. Where should I put the locker room? Ugh. All right, let's talk to, let's, well, what's this? Mm, from the color of this gravel and the stank of this fish smell, I'd say that Marzipan recently cleaned out her aquarium. It's some stank gravel from Marzipan's aquarium. Ew, stank gravel, gross. Are the cool tapes cool enough to compete in my Battle Royale of the Bands? Battle Royale of the Bands? Hmm. Oh, too bad. Too bad? 
Your contest is on the same weekend we're playing a benefit show for the endangered Lithuanian albino vegan bat, like poor little Pasquale over there. You're turning down a shot at the big time to sing for a bunch of salad munching, pink eyed, no blood suckers? Yep. Cool types glamour shots. Suitable for framing, autographing, or elaborate voodoo rituals. I'll just take one, in case I need to place an emergency hex on marzipan or something. Hey, Melissa Ben, this is Wade. Wade from Bad Aid. <laughs> Poetry. Um, listen, you got any cool tapes photos with just that baseball bat dude in them? Those other two creatures are really starting to freak people out around here, and not in the good way. <laughs> Be well, Samling. Nah. I can't use that mailbox. Hey, an electric stew pot. Ow! Making some victory chowder after you find a singer, eh? Tasty. <laughs> okay, I made a box up here. Ooh, uh... Hey, Pom Pom, I'm a big fan of your piano tinkling and thought you might like to sign up for my Battle of the Bands. You're looking for a singer and won't perform anywhere until you find one. It's a bottle of wine. <laughs> the way me so what I must go. Whoa, Escar, go. Club Techno Chocolate's going really upscale. Or maybe this is just a sneaky solution to their snail problem. Me, 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 I've me, never me, had Escar go. You know that? Never had it. Mmm, a plate of barbecued buffalo wings. Ooh, what? It's one of Pom Pom's instrumental piano albums. How he still managed to get chicks without squealy vocals or guitars is beyond me. Ooh, what? See what's up with this box. It's a smooth pom pom poster. I wonder how many teenage girl balloon people have one of these on their bedroom wall. What are you doing hanging out in a cool club like this? Yeah. You no, know, there's no real chocolate, right? I'm trying to walk up the north to audition for pom pom. Audition? For what? Pantsless wonder? Pom Pom scouring the globe for Singer to zazz up his instrumental piano stylings. Pom Pom looks like a beach ball on a mission. He's going through bunches of glossies and demo tapes, looking for a singer to turn his piano act into a smash hit duo. Oh, man. Hey, Homestar, how'd you like a one-way coach class ticket to total stardom? Ooh, a battle of the bands. Yeah, for only a few handfuls of cash, you could be the next limousine. Oh, but I don't have any handfuls of cash. And I'm not in a band. At least not yet. So why aren't you auditioning? Aside from the complete lack of talent, I mean. I would, but I forgot my accompanying music. Break an arm, good buddy. Hey, check out this vintage retro ironic vinyl wax. 
Ooh, food-related love. That's what I was gonna sing for my audition. Crank that puppy up and watch me walk my magic. It was like... Way me to what I it was like go. right next to you, man. And now for a moldy oldie from the Bomberino himself. Girl, we got a food related love. And it makes me want to see. It's a hot and tangy feeling, kind of like a. Strong bed? That doesn't rhyme. Oh, I see. I gotta help him. Me, 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 me. Once more, but this time with feeling. See, I'm helping him. Girl, we got a food related love. And it makes me want to see. It's a hot and tangy feeling, kind of like a. Like a buffalo wing. Blue cheese away. We can dine in, or we can take it to go. Our food related love makes me all tipsy, kind of queasy. Like a. Plate of snails? That doesn't rhyme. Ooh -ah. <laughs> Oh my god. Let's try this again. Girl. And it makes me want to see. It's a hot and tangy feeling, kind of like a... Like a buffalo wing. Blue cheese away. We can dine in, or we can take it to go. Whoa. Our food related love makes me all tipsy, kind of queasy. Like a... <laughs> buffalo wings? Ew, that doesn't rhyme. Me, 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 me. No, okay. Don't go nowhere. I'm not leaving until I'm a. Hey. Way me to what I this is slightly go. annoying, and but. Now for a moldy oldie from the Pomerino himself. I'm gonna repeat this every time. It's a hot and tangy feeling, kind of like a. Like a buffalo wing. Blue cheese away. We can dine in, or we can take it to go. Whoa. Our food related love makes me all tipsy, kind of queasy. Like a. A bunch of glowy bottles? Um, uh, guess not. Arg! Art. What I must go. He doesn't know he doesn't know what escargot is, so you know. Nothing says snooty like garlic covered snails. Ooh -ah. That's Pom Pom's piping hot stew pot. All right, let's try this again. Maybe we can use the soup pot. It's one of Bomb Bomb's instrumental to me. God damn it. Once more, but this time with feeling. It's a lot of trial and error. Girl, we gotta burn. It's a hot and tangy feeling, kind of like a. We can't, we can't go over there though. Like a buffalo wind. I used to think it was more lot till you told me not. And when we food related kids, 
They never food with lady pills. Our lips are all slimy and juicy. Like a... Like the top water shell. So nasty. Little bones and buttery. And they move so slow. It's just like me, go The way I move across the dance floor. Our love is related to food. And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a... Um, like a... Hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. Hot? I'm pretty sure that doesn't rhyme. Me, 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 me. God damn it. Go away, me. Go away, strong man. Our love is related to food. And you know oh, that wait. it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a... Um, like a... Hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. 16th century samurai sword? Oh, is that a... Oh my god. At least what? it didn't make it start from the beginning. I'll give it that. And now for a more Our love is related to food. And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a... Um, like a... Hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. Bob, Bob? I'm almost positive that doesn't rhyme. Both of those stew and you would have worked, but go away, home me, stars so an idiot. Once, I must go. once more, but this time our love is related to food. And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a um like a hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. Molo? Molo does it. Do away me so what I must go. Maybe maybe we have to click on home star. Our love is related to food. And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a um like a hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. Strong bed? That doesn't rhyme. I was clicking on you! Dingus? I was clicking on you, not me! Our love is related to food! And you know that it's true! It's warm and bubbly too! Just like a... Um... Like a... Hang on, hang on. Give me a minute. Strong bed? That doesn't rhyme. I'm getting frustrated. I'm getting frustrated. Me, 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 me. This puzzle's frustrating me. Because it's about an idiot trying Once to get an more, idiot to, do, to, to say what you want him to say. To ah. And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. It's like a... Um... Like, uh, hang on, hang on, give me a minute. Plate of snails? That doesn't rhyme. Uh, Ooh, uh, let's talk to him. Let's talk to him. Maybe he just needs to know there's stew in the pot. How's Pom Pom picking potential partners anyway? He's looking for a smooth voice, good looks, and gorgeous gams. But most of all, he wants somebody who can improvise lyrics to go along with his piano playing. 
Bom Bom looks like a beach ball on a mission. It's going He's okay. Going I thought this part was pretty case. funny Looking until it got frustrating. Into a smash hit duo. You know? What happened out there, man? I don't know, Strong Man. One second I was singing my mouth off, when all of a sudden my mind went totally blank. There's a shock. I looked around for something for inspiration, but I guess the words didn't rhyme. No, it didn't. Not this time. Are you gonna audition again? Maybe, but I'm really scared that I'll have another lyrical brain. Freeze? Yeah. Don't worry. If you're stuck, just keep your eye on me. Really? Sure, it'll be funny. I mean, great. It'll be great. Break an arm, good buddy. The way me uh -oh. so much I must go. This is this is a little bit moon logic. Hey, an electric stew pot. Ow! Making some victory chowder after you find a singer, eh? Tasty. This is a little bit moon logic y. Uh, the problem I had here was that they said stew pot. Me, 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 me. So I assumed since it was hot and on that there was stew in it. <clears throat> but apparently it's an empty stew pot that is turned on for some reason. I need to put cheese in Ooh, it. Maybe I can make some bubbling cheese lava to dangle the cheat over. Whoa, this actually made a nice fondue. Even better to dangle the cheat over. All right, I'm going to put that under the moon logic category. The way me so what I must go. Who thinks of fondue? And you know that it's true. It's warm and bubbly too. Mm. Just like a... Um, like a... Hang on, Google. Give me a minute. Just like a pot of fondue. Yeah. Great? Me? Oh, pshaw. You want to make me a star? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, Mr. Bob. Yes, sir. The way me so what I must go. So, Pom Pom, about my Battle of the Bands contest. A consort? Let's do it. What do you mean I'm not ready? I've been training my lungs out for hours. You don't believe in me. Hooray! I won't let you down, Colonel Palm. Everything looks good. Now for the entry fee. We'll send Bubs a check. Me, 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 me. That's one band. Coach Z! Oh, hey there, strong man. I gotta say, Coach, I really hate what you've done with the place. 
Steppenwolf strong, man. I've found that stamping my name on everything helps keep my mind off more important matters, like unrequited love. Ooh. The heck was that? What's with all the sighing about marzipan? Oh, marzipan. My little baseball bat in a dress. Ew. You ever think about getting together with Bubs for a 2 duo reunion? I used to, but since we broke up, Bubs thinks I've gone soft. Plus, right now, I'm too depressed about other things. Marzipan, marzipan. If you're so into marzipan, why not tell her how you feel? I love watching train wrecks. I'm too afraid she'll reject me. If only she'd give me a sign. A sign, eh? I think I'll just back away slowly and leave you to your various miseries. Oh. Colonel Rockbottom's half ply bathroom tissue. Too gross. More like too nasty. The Colonel and I just had an audience about an hour ago. He gave me the Medal of Honor. Ew. To half ply. Jugga jugga jow! Squeedle now! No boxes. It's a hanger. Well, well, well. So we meet again, Mr. Wire Hanger. Not so high and mighty now, are we? That's a yoink. Get your hands off my toilet papes. Hey, I don't see your name on it. Wait a minute. I do see your name on it. Rappers are always putting their names on their necklaces and teeth and jeweled crunk goblets. So I figured why can't the fella put his name on his own tukas paper? Wow. You are a true baller, Coach Z. Mrs. Marzipan Z. Oh, joy. It's a poster from the Cool Tapes last tour. Hmm, industrial strength bleach. This might come in handy. Don't touch that. I'll be needing it later to clean out my urinals. And so we take it when he's gone. Quit messing with my orifice. Ew, please never say that again. You used to have a roll of toilet na Mrs. paper named Shit Be Gone. Nice. Hey, coach, I got you something. Oh, it's another picture of Marzipan. I'll just store it with all the others. Maybe someday I'll get the nerve to ask her to autograph one of these things. Okay. What happened to all the pointless trophies? Pointless? Gold-painted plastic trophies are a lasting symbol of parents forcing kids to play sports. And I sold them for two bucks. All right. Maybe we can get her to sign it. I don't know what the deal is with the aquarium out here, but whatever. Two bucks. Two bucks. Oh. No, I don't want to. I didn't click on the door. Whatever game. What up? My mouse is on the pictures. It didn't pick the front door. The heck? Look, I, right. What the heck? Right there, front door. Right here's glossies. Oh my god. I'll just take another one. <laughs> hey, Marzipan. Could I get you to sign this cool tapes picture? Sure thing. Who should I make it out to? 
How about one for Coach Z? Oh, I'm not so sure that's a good idea. He's been sending us some pretty disturbing fan mail lately. That's just Z being Z. Oh, okay. Dear Coach Z, all my best, Marspan. Cool. I'm sure he'll love it. Hey, Coach, I got you something. Can't you see I'm obsessing and compulsing over here? To Coach Z, all my best, Marzipan. You hear that? All her best! That constitutes a legal marriage in some shady countries. You better get over there, Don Juan, before she downgrades to some of her best. Good point. Thanks, Strong Bad. Dude, he's creepy. He's a creepy creepster from Creepville. Warning! This bleach is caustic, vile, and dangerous. Always handle with protective gloves and headgear, or severe bleaching, poisoning, and other not good side effects may result. Wow! Caustic, vile, gloves, headgear? It's like this stuff was made for me! Nope, get the toilet paper. Don't worry, my little rolls of marginally absorbent toilet paper. Papa Strongbad will protect you from Coach Z's unspeakable gluteal regions. That means his butt. I wonder how Coach Z's mound of unwashed socks and crusty jocks is doing. Uh, I think it just waved at me. Coach Z should put a lock on this thing someday. Or some glass. Okay. We got some bleach. And we got some... Let's just drop off our thing. Oh, he's gone. He's not here. Where's he at? Maybe take this. robot it's omniscient omnipotent and i'm awesome now keep your hands off my stuff while i go back to planning your concert why didn't you just build me one of those to run security oh we can pour bleach on it maybe That's a really, really good idea. Really. But laundry bleach like this should only be used in laundry type situations. Lame. I think the Zen Rock would feel more aligned with its Shaka Khans somewhere else. Nope. Wait, where is he at? Speaking of him planning my concert, where is he? Oh, there he is. Bubs! Strongwell! How's it shaking, bacon? Hey, Bubs! I suckered Homestar and Pom Pom into performing at the Battle Royale! Homestar and Pom Pom have a band? That sounds like a delicious catastrophe! 
Oh, it will be. But hey, as long as Pom Pom's check clears, I'll happily watch as they go down in flames. Well, that's one band down. Get a couple more to sign up and we'll have ourselves a contest. Bubs! Strong bad? Hey, Bubs, why don't you enter my Battle of the Bands? Cause I'm not in a band anymore, and battles give me gas. What happened to you and Coach Z's band? You mean the 2-0 duo? We broke up when Coach Z went soft. Our songs used to be all about sticking it to the man and kicking it to the chief. My name's Coach Z, and Bubs is my cohort. Mm. Put on your cheap kickers and mm. kick for mm. sure. Mm. But now all he does is obsess over marzipan and sleep in a locker. No, the 2 o duo is through o until Coach Z starts acting like an OG. Okay. Well, I've got rock history to write. Catch you on the flip side, boobs. See you later, promotinator. Let's go back here. Coach, how goes your stomach churning quest for marzipans? Uh, hand? Not so good there, strong bad. Now that I'm here, I'm all froze up. What should I do next? Well, you could try holding a boombox over your head for a few days. I tried that once. Didn't go so hot. So. Still striking out with all. I can't even get her attention. Try reading some poetry. All the hot lady types love poetry. Hey, that's right. And if there's one thing I know, it's how to bust a fat rhyme. Yo, one, two, one, two. Uh, yo, what light breaks through that window there? It's a uh, marzipan, and she's got yellow hair. Okay, forget the poetry. Still striking out with all. I can't even. Well, if you want to get her attention, you probably should throw some of those pebbles at her window. That's how they do it in the movies all the time. Hmm, you think? Sure. Nothing. Beating Coach Z with rocks is always fun, but I think this rock's destined to do something more sneaky. Okay, and uh, okay, we're gonna put it in the pile here. These little bits of gravel need a big brother to look up to. There yeah. we go. Hopefully, Zen Rock's example will keep these pebbles from turning to a life of crime or erosion. Still striking out with old baseball bat? I mean, marzipan? I can't even get her attention. Got any ideas? I think you should take another shot to throw in those pebbles at her window. Again? I've got a good feeling about them this time. Okay. Yoo-hoo. Oh, faddle. I'll be over somewhere else. Strong Bad, what do you think you're... Coach Z? You know you're not allowed within 500 feet of my house. But my darling, gay Your darling? You just busted my super energy efficient window. Now skid at. Ah, uh, what'd I do? Man, that was great! It was? Throwing rocks through old man Mazapan's windows. Just like we used to rap about in the old days. Yeah, those was some good times. The old one, two, a one, one, two. They sure were, man. Well, I got a concert to promote Plan and Embezzle from. Keep on keeping it real, you wussy green sellout. Well, do. Throwing rocks through old So, Marzipan how'd it go with Marzipan? Windows. Not so good. Breaking hearts and breaking windows. Strong bad style. Get it in. Wait, I'm confused. Are they back together as a band? You don't hit rock bottom. That's not where I wanted to go.
Where, where, where did the coach go? Oh, strong man. You sure you want to enter the battle royale? Now, while Code Z's still a sellout. Yeah, but what if he suddenly, I don't know, became cool again? <laughs> he dunked on us. I might think about joining back up with the thin green duke if he started acting like his old self again, breaking the law, raising the ruckus, the kind of stuff we used to rhyme about. Break law, raise ruckus. Got it. He's he he's raising well, ruckus. Rock okay, we got, we got to get him to raise some ruckus. I don't know where he is now though. We're probably gonna have to stop playing in a, in a little bit. The mound just asked me for a dollar. You don't hit rock. I need to find a ruckus investor. Yeah. Exactly. Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is it, Strong? I can't believe Good Z broke your window. At least it's only one window this time. Back when the 2 duo was popular, my windows were being broken every other day. Ah, uh, good times. Sure you won't change your mind about entering my Battle of the Bands? As long as these poor bats are endangered, the cool tapes will stand ready to rock on their behalf. I don't think I can unendanger some bats. Instinct is not in danger. <laughs> That's true, I suppose. You're not wrong. How go the security preparations for my legendary music thingy? Oh, not too bad. I use my lunch hours to continue pursuing my dream of being a snooty rock journalist. And besides, this yellow jacket is like a magical backstage pass to all the acts. Think of all the juicy gossip I'll pick up. Uh, you know, okay, you got a positive view. Good for you. Can't get the star back. All right, well, um, not sure what to do now. I don't know where Coach Z went off to. Oh, the photo booth was missing from our little, uh, our little map. Sticks there. I mean, when in doubt, check your email, right? That won't do anything. I don't see how a concert's gonna keep this guy from drowning in Darwin's gene pool. Don't you listen to him, Pasquel. Ooh, that's a really, really good idea. Nah. It says it's a really, really good idea no matter what I use it on, so it's not a really good idea. Well, all right! Uh... 
Oh, all right. Let's check our email. Let's see if we got any. I don't know where Coach Z is either. He just kind of disappeared. Maybe he's in our basement. I don't know where else he would be. This ought to get the tough stains out of, well, anything. Uh, well, we need to get stains out of something. Cool, a marathon of those to prehab. Oh, he's not in here. Well, if there's anything we need stains getting out of, we have we know where what to do. All right, I was here to check my email. In a world of stupid emails, one man stands ready with his delete key. Hey, we have an email. Dear Strong, you've got to help me. One of my fellow cow workers won't stop staring at me. Creeped out of my mind, please. Yeah, how are you cow workers supposed to get them doggies rolling if somebody's staring at you? When people stare at me, I just divert their attention to something I want them to do, say, or buy for me. Or in your case, cows you'd like punched, barns you'd like raised, or trails you would like to see happy. Yippee ki yay, -yay strong bad. <laughs> that would be it. That would be nothing. I don't see how that helped me at all. I won't use these showers unless there's some sort of national emergency or a saucy women in prison movie being filmed. Wah. For my money, nothing comes to. You know, I haven't tried to talk to the other two about this whole thing. You know that? What's the word, big guy? You can talk to him after rehearsal, Strong Bad. Quiet, you! Man, you gotta stop wasting your time with Marzipan and join a real band. I don't know something with everything with that band! A three album deal with guaranteed four point back end? Ding dang, maybe I should join the cool tapes. Maybe you should stop interrupting our rehearsals. Nah. Nope. It's the Duo Duo's debut album. Oh, wait. It's actually called De Butt Album. Man, this thing has all the Duo Duo's. Stealing stuff from my own store. Nice. I do not know what to do. 
marzipan always keeps your kitchen boarded up when strong mad's around. So, we're gonna stop playing and we're gonna do it tomorrow. Because goodness knows, after I sleep on it, that's when I get all my in my inspiration and ideas.